Hello, today we are going to be showing you a tutorial on how to use Google Docs, so let's get started. Google Docs was recently merged into Google Drive to create a large online service to help create and keep documents organized and accessible from anywhere in the world. Google Drive can be used to display files for you and others to access and edit. By watching this video, you will learn how to upload, share, and access your documents. Now click on the Drive button right here. You will then come to this page. You will log in with your Gmail account right here, or you can sign up in this top right hand corner. Although I have my own Gmail account, so I'm going to go straight and log in. Once you have logged in, you will be taken here. This is the Google Drive homepage where you can create documents, spreadsheets, presentations, and much more. This is where your documents will be displayed for you and others to access and edit at the same time. Now we're going to create documents and share them with many different people. To create your document, first click on the Create button right here. You will then see this drop down menu for different options of what type of files you want to make, such as the following, presentations, documents, spreadsheets, and much more. Today we will be making a document, so click here. This will then open a new window that looks very similar to Microsoft Word. If you understand how to use Word, this will be very simple. You will be creating a, your documents here as well as sharing it from here, but that will be explained later. First, tell your document by clicking here. This will open a mini window where you will name your document. For this, we will name it Google Docs Tutorial. Now just press OK. Once you have inputted your title, now you can start on your document. This part is similar to Microsoft Word and similar to many other document softwares with font, color, and size option as well as many other features. Now we will write a small paragraph then show you how to save and share your documents. Once we have created our document, we are now going to save and share by clicking on this button right here. You will now appear here. This is a link right here for your document. Now we are going to go into the privacy settings right here and say change. You have the options for public on the web, anyone with a link, or private. We're going to do anyone with a link. This will allow anyone who gets this link either in an email or if they type in the URL, they will go straight to this and they will be able to see it and edit it. Now say save. Here, this just says who's the owner, which is me. Add people. You're able to add emails to this and then they'll get an email directly with the link in it. From here, we're going to now copy the URL and say done. We have now finished and it's now going to appear on the home page. We are now back on the home page and as you can see our document right here is appearing. Okay, now we are going to be teaching you how to install Google Drive and how to sync up your documents with your Google Drive. This Google Drive syncs your files directly to your computer which is a great way to save time because you can just drag and drop the documents directly to a folder which will then sync directly to your Google Drive account. Now we will show you how this works. First download the Google Drive by clicking here. Once you have clicked here, you will go through some quick and easy download steps. First click accept and install. And click yes. Now this will install Google Drive. And just click close. Now it will appear right here. So just click on it and sign in. Once you sign in, it will take you to a getting started window. Now just press next and then start sync. This may take a while so be patient. This will open a window which shows you your Google Drive which allows you to drag and drop your documents here. From here you can go into your documents, pick any document and drag and drop it right into the Google Drive. Let's pick this one. As you can see it's now dragged right here and is 
now on your Google Drive. Now, as you can see, it has appeared right here on our Google Drive home. I think the software is very good and it has a great purpose. It is very easy to use and very easy to learn. By using this, it not only helps people, but it makes their time much more efficient. So now you know everything you know, need to know about how to use Google Drive. Now thanks for watching it, and if you have any further questions, please just ask them in the comment box. Thank you. Goodbye.